Our next guest loves to keep our Warner Brothers Fire Department on their toes. Please welcome back our science guy, Steve Spangler. Thank you very much. Hey, I wanted to say thank you very much for, you know, you said take some of the experiments and put them in the book, and I, you said for teachers and so forth, and, and we did, and thank you for being in the book. So fire bubbles exploding you. and uh, exploding toothpaste, uh, and that's, uh, yeah, I'm in the book, and thank you so much for putting me in the book. I appreciate it's a very, it's, it's fun, you very it's very thank entertaining you. and educational. How very fun. Hey, uh, put on your safety glasses. All I always right. have your safety glasses early okay. on, and uh, have you ever heard somebody talk about a sugar high? You know, they say sure. kids have a sugar high. So I have uh, gummy bears, so mm -hmm. here's our little gummy bears. Okay. Uh, and they're they're, they're packed with energy. So when you feed them to a kid, of course, they're, they're crazy. So here's what I have here is I have this liquid. Um, it's not just gummy bears you feed to a kid that is crazy. I mean, it's just candy in general, right? I have a liquid here that's full of oxygen. It's a great oxidizer. So what I'm gonna do is take some of the gummy bears, I'm gonna drop them down inside, and I'm gonna show you how to release the energy from the gummy bears. Okay. Okay, fair and enough. What's the liquid in there? It's, a, it's an oxidizer. It's called potassium chlorate. It's I an see. oxidizer. Okay, so you stand back just a little bit. I no, you're perfect, right there. Okay, you ready? So I'm gonna drop them in here like this, so watch this. So, oh, beautiful. Look at the energy that comes out. Isn't that amazing? That's amazing. That glow. Wow. Is, wow. That never does that at home. Uh, <laughs> yikes. And, and the you hear noise. howling? Yes. So we call it screaming gummy bears. And, and the fumes are only slightly toxic, which is nice. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, yeah. So I'm glad I'm not wearing yeah. them. Yeah, no, no, it's fine. Yeah. And the nice thing about this is that uh, it smells like a campfire. Isn't that kind of fun? It yeah. is. It Can't is. Can't quite right. smell it yet. But what, what's in there now? Way. What's happening? Well, just now it's destroyed. So now you truly just have the sugar that's kind of cooked away, and that'll be an artifact that I'll take back and share with everybody because uh, since it was on the show. All right. All right. Hey, we're, we're talking about uh, uh, chemicals that are packed with energy, and this is ethanol. Mm -hmm. They take ethanol and they put it in gasoline. Ethanol is great because it just burns so cleanly, mm -hmm. you know? So a little bit of ethanol here, and a little bit here, and a little bit here, and so these are, I, I call them like Frankenstein bottles because uh, there's a little bolt in between each uh, yes. of them. And can you see inside, see there's a little gap that's I, inside there, I it's do. a little spark. So if I turn it this way, you can see the little gap that's inside that's right there. There it is, right there. So here's what we're gonna do is, um, I thought I'd cap off each one of these, all right? So here we go, there's one, and here's one, nice. And then I was gonna have you light them on fire, okay? So here's how you do it, because who wants to strike it? You know what I mean? So I brought this thing that produces 50,000 volts of electricity. So when you touch it like this, see that electricity that's there? I do. So you are gonna push this button. Right. That's gonna create the electricity, and then you're gonna reach over and touch the little spark, and, and you're gonna make a spark, and that's gonna, it's like what happens in an engine. We get an explosion, sure. all right? Seems safe. Right. Yeah, well, it's perfectly safe. Okay. All right, so just hold it right there, and Here? just squeeze, and just squeeze, the, squeeze the button. All right. Yeah, and now touch it over there. Ready, touch. <laughs> Isn't that nice? Yeah. Here, I got two more. Try this okay. one over here. So it's just like an engine. Just really nice. That one there should be a good one. Bam, they... Nah, that was a beautiful wow. one. Isn't that fun? Yeah. So... So when we're looking at like rockets or so forth, this is like uh, Newton's third law for reaction. There's an equal and opposite reaction. There's the ethanol that's inside here. So uh, a rocket's all about like the fuel coming out and I don't have a nozzle. So here's what we're gonna do. There's enough... A few, uh, there's enough uh, oxygen there that I think it'll be just perfect for us. So here's what's gonna happen. This goes down here, and then I'm gonna light this on fire. Great. Okay? So, uh, and then it kind of gives us a back to the future effect that I think you'll like, right? So here, watch this. So here, just gonna light the torch like this. All right, perfect. And now here, watch what happens, watch. <laughs> Is that just amazing? It's just this All right. All right. Nice. That's great. We're going to take a break, and uh, we come back. You have uh, something over there that we're going to head to and uh, probably light more things on fire. Maybe. Why not? We'll be right back. Thank we're back with Steve Spangler. He has one more experiment that Jeannie apparently is going to uh, volunteer for. Yes. Thank, you, thank you for doing it. You've heard of an electric chair? Does that sound horrible, an electric chair? It's not so good. that's why we've created an electric stool. All right, yeah. so, okay. so, so this is 50,000 volts of electricity here on the electric stool. See uh, how, what it looks like So here? wait, lift that up again? So yeah. that basically just lit that bulb by yes. putting that there. Yeah, because it's 50,000 volts. So that's why, Jeannie, I'd like to have you stand on it with bare feet, okay? So, it's, I honestly, I got the plans off the internet, so it's fine, I know, for a fact. All right, so that, oh, perfect, all right? Ellen, would you be kind enough to stand on the other side over there? Yes, right? I will. So here's Bye, what's Jeannie, going to happen. Bye, Jeannie, I love working um, with you. Is Jeannie, <laughs> We're gonna pass 50,000 volts around your body, 
All right, so here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna hang on here, and Ellen, would you hang on to the other I, end right uh, here? Yeah, I'm not yeah, gonna yeah, hold that's anything perfect. At So all. it's okay, you're gonna hold your hand right here, it's okay. Yeah, and no, come a little closer. Yeah, the perfect, right there, okay? So now watch what happens. When I turn this on, it's gonna go around your body, shoot across here, and watch what happens. Ready, here we go. Ah, beautiful. Here, slide your hand down, Jeannie. You can actually see it's 50,000 volts of electricity lighting the, the tube on and off. You've got it going around wow. your body. Is that cool? But it gets better, all right? It gets better. So watch this. Ellen, would you join me You're over here? You're charging that whole thing. What, what yeah. I was thinking was this. You, for this last one, you should put on safety glasses because you know those little bottles that you ignited over there? I do. I was wondering what would happen if you ignited big bottles over here? Yeah. And since neither of us want to be that close to it, Jeannie's going to power it. So I'm going <laughs> to fire it up. It's going to go around her body. She's going to take her hand. She's going to touch the ball. That will send the spark over there, and it should be great. Okay. If not, we run, all right? <laughs> All right, Jeannie, okay. yeah, you're powered up. Are you feeling good? Feeling okay, I'm going to count you in. Ready? Here we go. Put your hand right over there. Three, two, one, touch. <laughs> wow. She did it. Isn't that awesome? She She's a human conductor of electricity. You're so powerful. Powerful. All right. Well, you're all going home with a copy of Steve's new book, Fire Bubbles and Exploding Toothpaste.